51,000 and today I have two Timus left. These are for Christmas and I haven't been able to do them and I need to wrap them. So we're going to do this video real quick and then I'll get them wrapped. Stay tuned. Okay guys, so I'm going to bring you down so you guys can see. Alright, we're going to do this one. This is for my grandbaby. And I had it for a while, but because of everything happening with my mother and all the car stuff, we just haven't been able to do a video on it. That's why I haven't opened it yet. Um, hold on just a moment. So I don't know if you remember this little good dude dad, this little guy here. I'll take him out. I bought him thinking I was going to get the doll. I got the bear and not the doll. So I really wanted the doll, so I sucked it up and got the doll for her. So, um, and of course it goes with the bear. So. Um, that will be fine. So we're going to open this up. I hope I like it. Um, yeah, I hope she likes it. So let me see. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, I was afraid I'm going to cut it open, you know, on something. So. Okay. Oh, she's cute. Hopefully I can open her up so you guys can see. Um, let's see here. Hmm. I want to open her. I want to make sure she's good for what I paid. Now, I paid this little girl, I paid $21.81 for it. I thought it was a little steep. And I wouldn't have done it if it wasn't Christmas. But I really wanted this for her because this is handmade. And I thought, oh, this will be so cute. And if she doesn't play with it, that's fine. You know, she can put it up on a shelf maybe or something. I don't know, in her room or something. I think she is adorable. Oh, wow, she is really cute. Yeah, she's got a little, little purse and the sweater on there. Aw, this is cute. Her face is cloth. It's a cloth face. Very, very cute. And she's got little slippers on, little shoes. Very soft. Don't know what that was. Do you? I have no clue what that was. That was a big bang. I don't know. I need to go check. Hold on. Did you hear that? Okay, guys, I don't know what it was. But it was a big bang. I didn't see nothing. Okay, so this is really cute. The dress is all handmade. The sweaters and everything are handmade. She's really cute. I'm glad I got her. Do I think she's worth the $22? Yeah, maybe $15. I mean, she's small. She's not a big doll. But she's handmade, too. So somebody's put their heart into this. So, you know. So, very cute. I like her. Her face is so, so nice and, and uh, really, really cute. So I got that for her. So the next thing I got is for fur baby, my fur baby, and he's in the other room so I can open this up. I will wrap it for him so he has something to wrap up. I got a little hole in here. Okay, let me see what I got this. I got this the other day. Um, I've been wanting this for a while. And I had to, I kept 
putting in my basket and taking it out. And so I finally, I finally got it. So. And this is a dog dish and but the thing is it's raised because I don't have one and I was reading about it and I think they're realizing that dogs and cats need to have their necks up higher than what we're feeding them and it's, it's better for their digestive system and Bruno has fits and there, a lot of them are, are seizures um, but he coughs a lot too so I was thinking maybe this might help him and this is going to I'm not going to take it out because I'm going to wrap this for him so um, and then we'll take it out on Christmas and, and check it out more it gives you two dishes and it also gives you a red leg so you can raise it, it is adjustable it's for all kinds of animals so if you have a big dog it, it, you can adjust it up taller or if you have a small one, you can just have it lower a little bit. So, but it's supposed to help with their digestive system. Um, it's $16.55, and that's exactly what I paid for it. So, it's the same price. There are three, three sizes. Medium. Oh, these. This one's a medium one. There are some that go down and up. So this is, this is for under 20 pounds. They have a large for 40 pounds. And the extra large for 100 pounds and under, so you can you can do it that way. I thought I got it in white. I had another one too, and I think it got discontinued or something. So hopefully this will work a little bit better. I might get him a water fountain because he doesn't like to drink water too often. He, um, you know, if we give him something that's a little salty, he'll eat it and then he'll go for the water but um, a lot of times he don't drink enough water so I will show you how it's supposed to look these are the three sizes here so you guys can see the adjustable little ones there so and they have all kinds of them like this you can spend a lot of money on them you can spend next to nothing on them so it depends what you want to do so I want about medium, I guess. Anyways, we're gonna wrap these two. That's all I have from Timu. Um, yeah. So we, um, I'll do. Uh, yeah. So that's gonna be nice. I think that that'll help him a lot. I'm hoping. So that is all i got everything is wrapped pretty much except for these two and i've got stuff over there to be mailed i'm going to try to get that done this afternoon and then i'll go see my mom and uh, get that all done so um yeah yeah um so the update on my mom is that she is now in a facility she's been there for a couple of days um I did contest it at the hospital for her to come to stay longer, but of course they denied my contest. So um, I was going to bring her home and do rehab for her like I did before um, with one of the companies I used to work for. Um, but then I had two people tell me about this facility. It's a new facility. It's just for rehab. There is no nursing home. It is just strictly for rehab. You do three hours a day of rehab and you stay there between seven and ten days and then you go home, you eat there, you stay there. They have a lovely room. The place is brand new. So it, the rooms are nice and big and they give you a seat to a chair and I can sleep there if I want to. A lot of spouses will stay with them and um, while they're doing it and they can stay there the whole time. They they'll feed you and your your they feed her plus 
you know, visitors if you want. I think you pay five dollars for for food, <coughs> or sometimes they just give it to you free. It depends, and um, so you can eat there. She will not be home for Christmas. Um, I put her in here, and she's loving it. The bathrooms are immaculate. You should see them. They're so you, they have the chairs, the shower chairs, and they just wheel them in and help them with their showers. And they teach them to be more independent and then trying to do it for them. When you're in a nursing home, if you come in and they ask you, you want to go to rehab, if they don't feel good that day or whatever, they say no, then they don't care. And they go, they, they only do an hour a couple of times a week anyways. So uh, you have to yell and scream for showers. I've had her in two different ones and not impressed with either one of them. Um, so <coughs> I, I was just going to bring her home. The doctors weren't too happy about that, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. And I wasn't going to put her through all that stress. And me too, because it's stressful to have to yell and scream at people to get them to do their job. It's just too much. And you just get to a point where you, no, no, I'm not doing it. But this place is very friendly. They're very welcoming. They do a ceremony when they leave. They take a picture of them and they do the ceremony when they leave. So that's pretty cool. Um, and one guy, she said they um, had in there, I guess he came in on a walker and he left walking. Actually walking. So um, do I think she's going to get there? I doubt it. Um, but I do think that she's going to get better because when she was here, she couldn't even dress herself. Um, near the, Before she went in the hospital, she was not having that much trouble. She just couldn't focus. She was having really a lot of trouble. Now she's really doing well. So, And they work on people who are incontinent and how to control that a little bit better. So they're they're teaching her things that a nursing home would not teach you. Um, so I'm very pleased with this um, so far. We'll, we'll keep, you know, tabs on it and see how well. She seems happy. She's met a friend there. So she's got a lady she's talking with. Um, so that's good. Anyways, that's it for now. Um, I'm going to wrap these two so I can get my parcels out. And... Um, I hope everyone has a great Christmas and a Happy New Year. If I don't get anything up, I might. I should have something up because we're going to go camping um, the end of next week. Me and him, because she's in there, um, you know, I will. we're going to go not too far, but we're going to go somewhere a little different. It's a little further because we were going to go, you know, the ones that we've done before, but they're full. So we found another one that we have checked out before, and we've but we've never camped there. So, um, yeah, so we're going to, I guess, I think we're car camping. We're just going to car camp for a couple of days there. So we can do that. And um, if she comes home before then, then um, we can, um, you know, he was going to do a solo camp maybe uh, there. So um, then he would probably take his hammock and that there. So either way, you're going to see some kind, some kind of video up. So that's it for now, guys. I got, hope you all have a great Christmas. The best Christmas present I ever got was my mom still being here. So, um, yeah. So that's great because she was very, very close to not being here. So we don't want to go there. So anyways, enjoy. Monkey says she's out. And till the next one. Bye, y'all.